hello everyone in today's video we will solve one of the previous year question so we are given a 0.5 meter long cylindrical medium between the two conducting plates which has a uniform charge density so the axis of the cylindrical medium is along the z axis so we are given this cylindrical medium between the two conducting plates and this has a uniform charge density rho is equal to 100 nano coulomb per meter cube so this is the 0.5 meter length of the cylindrical medium so this is along the z axis so the left plate is at z equal to 0 and has a potential of 10 kilo volt and similar the right plate is grounded so this means this is a 0 volt and this z is equal to 0 0.5 so in this question we have to find out the electric field at the axial distance of 0.2 meter it's somewhere here so you have to find out the electric field at z equal to 0 0.2 meter so let's start solving this question so let's draw again so this is the equal to zero voltage is 10 kilo volt and this is z equal to 0 0.5 this voltage is zero volt so we have to find out this z this is z axis so at this distance this is z point 2 so we will divide this cylindrical medium into two parts because it is a uniformly charged so we can find the potential gradient across this cylindrical medium so this will be equal to 0 minus 10 kilo volt divided by 0 0.5 minus 0 so this will be minus 20 kilo volt per meter so this is in a potential gradient so, so per 0.1 meter there is a 2 kilo volt difference so if it is 10 kilo volt here so this there is a decrement of minus 2 per 0.1 meter so we can find out at z equal to 0 0.2 this will be 6 kilo volt now find out the electric field for finding the electric field we will divide this into two parts this is a left and the other one is right so because of these two parts there will be electric field so electric field at z equal to 0 0.2 due to left part will be equal to minus of this is 6 minus 10 divided by 0 0.2 minus 0, 0 0.2 minus 0 kilovolt per meter so this will become the six this is six minus ten is minus four minus minus is plus so this is four upon point two kilo volt per meter so this will be twenty kilo volt per meter similarly we will find out for right so there's a contribution from both the parts so this will be minus so we can find out this is 0 minus 6 0 minus 6 over 0 0.5 minus 0 0.2 kilo volt per meter so this will become 6 over 0 0.3 kilo volt per meter so this will be 20 kilo volt per meter so our net electric field 
at z equal to point two meter will be so electric field due to the uh, two parts will be in opposite direction this twenty kilo volt per meter minus twenty kilo volt per meter this so the contribution from the left and right parts are equal in magnitude but but its contribution in the direction is opposite so this will cancel out e net at the equal to point two meter will be zero and we also know the property that the electric field inside the conductor will always be zero so this is the solution for this question if you have any doubts related to this topic you can write me in the comment box if you find this video helpful please like share and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching this video